Hi, this is Mr. Estrada. In this video, we are going to cover how to use the distance formula to find the distance of two endpoints. The endpoints of PQ are P negative 3, 1 and Q 4, 25. Find the length of PQ. So we begin by labeling our coordinates. This is our first set, so we'll label this X1, Y1. And here's our second set. We'll label this X2, Y2. And so since we're going to use the distance formula, the distance formula is given here. So all we really have to do now is just substitute into the distance formula. So substitute for x2 using this value, substitute for x1 using this value, substitute for y2 using this value of 25, and substitute for y1 using this value of 1. So when we make our substitution, this is what it should look like. Notice here, right, I have a subtraction sign from the formula, and I also include the negative sign in front of x1. So then that's going to be 4 minus negative 3, that's 7. 25 minus 1 is 24. 7 squared is 49. 24 squared is 576 add them up we get 625 the square root of 625 is 25 so our answer is 25 the length of PQ is 25 okay thanks for watching take care